Today I have this reindeer head that I picked up at the Dollar Tree. And I'm going to start by taking a razor blade and just removing the antlers. If you have to remove it in pieces, that's fine. I was just trying to save these for a future project. So I set those aside and I did the same thing to the nose. I just popped that off easily, but the nose I will be gluing back on. So I'm just going to set that aside. Next, I found this headband at the Dollar Tree as well. And I liked how the antlers stood up a little higher and they're just a little taller. So I'm going to cut them off of the headband and I'm going to attach them to the reindeer head. And I'm just going to use some hot glue to reattach everything. I'm then going to take some Wiseau white primer. Now this step is totally optional. Sometimes I prefer to have a base color of white before I do my main color just so when I sand you get a little bit of white popping through rather than the bare wood. Once that had dried I then took my Wise Owl chocolate and I painted everything in the chocolate. Now you can totally pick any colors that you want for your deer head and the antlers. I got this book of scrapbook paper from Hobby Lobby. It comes with a total of 40 sheets and has a few different patterns. And I have different shape ornaments here. And I'm going to trace them on the back side of the scrapbook paper. And again, each scrapbook paper was its own pattern. And I did six different patterns. And then I'm going to cut all of those out. So you can really customize this to your liking. I just have the two different patterned ornaments, but if you have other ornaments or you can freehand, I think three different patterns would look nice as well. So once I had everything cut out and all my paint is dry, I'm gonna go back to the nose and paint that with some Wise Owl Republic Red. And I'm going to add a little bit of white to my bells that are on the antlers. Now I decided I'm going to keep the head and the antlers almost like a silhouette. So I'm going to leave them both this brown. But if you want to paint them or dry brush extra paint on, I would do this now before you glue it to your board. Now I have a piece of wood that I got from Hobby Lobby. I painted that white and I'm going to glue my head and antlers onto the board. And I'm just adhering that with some hot glue. And then I'm gonna glue my little red nose back on as well. I'm going to take some Wise Owl Furniture Salve. This is just a great top coat, especially for indoor projects. And I'm going to use my two inch palm brush to apply it. And I'm just doing a very light layer of the salve throughout the reindeer head. And then I'm gonna take my paper ornaments and I'm gonna arrange three on the left side and three on the right side to make it look like they are hanging from the antlers. Once I have them in place, I'm just gonna take some hot glue and attach them to my board. These do not have to be perfectly even. They can really hang however is pleasing to your eye. Once everything is glued down, I have a black paint marker and I'm just gonna add little dots going from the ornament up into the antler to make it look like the chain that the ornaments are hanging from. Now you could just freehand this or if you want to keep it pretty straight, I just have a straight edge here that I'm using as a guide. And then you can just go back through and make those little dots a little bigger. You can even add real string. There are many options for this step. And I did that on both sides. And then to finish it off, I just have some jute. I tied six bows using my jute. If you have a nice pretty Christmas ribbon, I think that would look nice as well. 
and I'm going to glue a bow at the top of each ornament. And I'm just using some hot glue to adhere those in place. And then there you go. Now we just have this really easy, cute ornament reindeer. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Paint products, tissue paper, transfers, and mesh stencils can all be found on our webpage at chalkitupfancy.com. And don't forget, you can also check out other tutorials over on our webpage. Have a great day.